Hello and welcome to Datazar. Today I'm going to show you how to use page templates at connect.datazar.com. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to datazar.com. We're going to log in. We're already logged in. I'm just going to click on it. And that's going to take you to dashboard on the main menu. So let's get rid of that. We're going to go full screen. To work on the website and to use the page templates, click on the website button. And these are the editing tools, post pages, templates, theme, settings. We're going to be working with templates. These are page templates right here. Quickly, let's tab over. This is our AAA Outdoor Scenes website. We have a home page, but that's the only page we have. So we're going to add a blog page and an about page up there. Let's go back over. And first of all, before we go to templates, quickly, let's go to pages here. And if you want to create a blank page, you can create a blank page here, but that's not a page template. Um, but that's how you create a blank page. If you want to edit a page, like our home index, you can edit it right here. You click on the edit button right here. You scroll down to edit. Go back to pages here. So what we're doing is we're going to go to the website button here. And then to work on templates, page templates, we're going to click on the templates button here. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to add a blog page. We can either do it on the drop down or just click the plus sign to create a page. And there it is. This is the editing uh, box for the blog page. So what we're going to do is we're just going to add a featured image here. And I have already have it loaded in my images. So we're going to just choose it here. We're going to use this featured image of El Capitan. And also we're uh, a hiking outdoor site um, on this tutorial. So what we're going to do is we're going to switch out this image here, this blog image. This is just a stock image. You can switch it out. You click on the insert, you highlight it, click on the insert edit image icon. You click on the up arrow. You can upload a new image, but we already have one in my images here. And the one that we're going to use is this one of Upper Yosemite Falls looking down. So we're going to use that and click OK. And let's just shrink that down just a little bit. Just drag the corner. And there it is. Welcome to our blog. You can add text under this. You just click Enter. You add more text if you like. Uh, we're going to go ahead and leave it as is. It, we're going to include post here since it's our blog page. We're going to leave that checked. And if you go to more options right here, if you want it on the top and bottom menu, you can do that. We're going to leave it just on the top menu. So when you're done, you click the Create button, and we just created the blog page. So let's go, it, when you create the page, it puts you back on pages. So let's go back to Templates to create one more page. This time, we're going to create an About Us page. So we're going to click on the plus sign to create the page. And again, this takes us to the editing box for About Us. This is all preloaded. Notice that Include Posts is not checked on this one. Again, we're going to, uh, on the more options, we're just going to leave it on the top menu. And then down here, we're not going to add a featured image. What we're going to do is we're going to use this as our featured image, but we're going to go ahead and we're going to switch this image out. So we click on the image to highlight it. Click the up arrow, or insert image, Im image icon, then click the up arrow. We're going to go back to my images. We have these preloaded. And... We're going to use this one here of El Cajon Mountain and click OK. So this is going to be our About Us of our Hiking Outdoors page. So we go ahead and switch that, but it still has the title About Us here. And then here, these words here, you're going to replace these. So replace with a mission statement etc. Okay, and then this image here, again, we're, we're an outdoor hiking website, so we're going to highlight that one. We're going to replace these three real quickly, and we're going to go to My Images, and we're going to use this one here, another one of El Cajon Mountain, and let's shrink that down a little bit. We're going to replace this one, up arrow, and back to my images, and we're going to use this one here, and we're just going to shrink that down to match the size, 
looks pretty good. And then one more. We're going to replace this one. Click the insert image icon. Click the up arrow. Go to my images. We're going to use this one of Nevada Falls. Click OK. And again, we're just going to drag it, shrink the corner. And then all these filler words um, here, these are filler words. You're going to back these out and replace with your own text. Okay, so then you replace this one with your own text. Let me just copy that. Control C, Control V, just highlight it, paste this, Control V. So you replace those with your own text. So there we go. We have our About Us page, and this is for the hiking page. It has a totally different look, but that's how you use the template. And oh, we're not going to do Include Post, but we need to create the page, so we're going to click Create. Okay, so we created the two pages. Let's tab back over to our AAA Outdoor Scenes website. We're going to refresh the page. And there it is. We have the blog page and the About Us page. Let's check them out. Here's the blog page that we did. There's the featured image. There's the image inside. Welcome to our blog. And here's a blog post that we already have loaded in our website. And we could click on Read More. Our be be latest beautiful rainbows. But there's our blog page. It already has a blog post attached because we left that checked. And then there's the About Us page. that We use this one as our featured image. This is About Us. And then these are the three images. And then you add some more text here. And then the nice thing about these, these pictures are all going to drop right below one another when you um, go to the uh, mobile view. So... If you go back to pages here now, you'll see that we have the home, the blog, and the About Us page. So we added those two pages here. And uh, real quickly, one other thing, content here. If you want to add an image, you can upload an image here. You click Upload. You choose Files. And then you just go here. You just find it on your computer. And um, we're going to do this one. Let's just add this picture here. And then once you see that green check mark that you know, you know that it's been added to my images. So there it is. But let's go back to the um, website button. And then real quickly, we have this help button here too. If you um, need any help, a good place to go is the feature tutorial videos. And it's recommended to watch the first feature tutorial video, How to Start Building Your Website. And uh, currently, that's going to be our fourth edition. So let's go back to Dashboard. And that's it. That's how to use page templates with Datasar Connect.